Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel on this, well, still the 1st of February. <laughs> if you watched the video before, you saw that that I spoke to you about um, being prepared for fire making. But once you get that fire going, what are you going to do with it? Okay, it's going to keep you warm, give you some light, give you a, a center point. But you also may want to boil water or cook on it. So these are some of the things. So what I've done, what, I, what I've had recently sent to me, a good friend of mine, he ordered a couple of these. These are these bags right here. These are actually, it's a um, cotton... Uh, wax bag smells terrible i don't know what they what they use what kind of wax they're using on it but it, it's awful smell uh but what's inside of it what i keep inside of it is i keep my zebra pot and my uh, uh for boiling water and for cooking in so inside of it i have a lid slide out it makes it a little easier for me to slide the pot out um and this this pouch I don't know where he got it from, uh, but uh, he got offline, and I really like it a lot, this pot, this, this bag. It's quite, uh, I mean, you can do, do a lot of stuff with it. You can store many things in it, actually. Uh, this one here is primarily for my uh, my zebra pot here, which you see right here. Uh, and inside of it, just to give you an idea, I mean, it has the lid, has a... Uh, it's like a bowl or a cooking pot right here with a handle on it right here, which I do carry with me. You can use it as a skillet, you know, but I don't use this as a skillet. I use it more for other things. What I do use for a skillet is what I have inside of it. That's my little mini skillet, okay? And you can put a piece of wood in here to give it some extension. This is a, uh, like a cast, it's not cast iron, it's a piece of steel. And um, man, this thing works great. I've, I've used it a good bit and it fits really well. I mean, it fits perfectly inside this pot. I can even put it in the very top. And then below that, I have um, some tinder in there. And in here, I keep some of my, some more of my, my tinder material, actually, this, this cotton bag. So this cotton bag is like the other cotton bags that I, you've seen in the video before. I, I carry a good bit of tinder on me because I don't want to get caught up not, not having anything. So and also inside of it, I keep a little book of matches right here. So that all goes inside of here. I keep that inside the pot. If you can get a better look right here. I keep it inside the pot. I put my skillet in there. I also have a um, a tea towel I keep in here, but I've misplaced it. I don't know what I've done with it. Anyway, it goes inside there, and I keep a few other things in there. Also, can even keep uh, some uh, uh, some other items inside here. It starts getting a little heavy, but you know it has everything inside of it. And and there you go. It's inside my zebra pot. So um, I definitely recommend these zebra pots. Man, these things right here are really good. I don't have just one. I've got two. I got the little one here also. And it comes with the same stuff on it with it, you know, also. This is a good for individual. I tend to carry this big one right here with me also because you can do more with it, you know. You can cook a bigger meal in it. You can cook one meal that can do you for the rest of the day. You can collect water in it also. You can filter water from it or filter water into it. Um, it and you can store stuff in it that you don't want to get damaged while you're traveling and, and, and this kind of stuff in your backpack. And, of course... Inside this bag, you can add even more stuff. Now, if I wanted to, I can put this little pot inside the big one if I wanted to also. That's another thing I could do. Uh, but I'd have to take out the main, the main, uh, all the secondary pot that I have in it, you know, uh, other things that, that I really want to carry with me. Anyway, getting it in here is not the easiest thing in the world because you really got to, you got to fight to get it in there. But uh, once it's in there, it's in there. Here we go. Look at there. It wasn't too bad this time around. I like it when, uh, when you think you think negatively, but positive things come out of it. That's really that's always a good point, you know. So <laughs> there we had it. Anyway, it's in there. I'm a little bit of a, still fighting to get it in there. This um the, the the problem is that the the handles they get caught up on the side. So anyway, it's in there, and then I can grab it by the sides here, and I can tighten it up, and there we go. It's all in there. Boy, it weighs a little bit too. It's not a lightweight, but anyway, just some uh, ideas here, uh, things to help you out. I like the zebra pots. Like I said, uh, you can get them pretty inexpensively. They make a newer one that's a little bit lower, a little bit rounder. With it already has the and it has the, the handles on it, which is really nice, also. Uh, but um, I'm sticking with this right here. I've had this right here for about at least 16, 17 years. I've used it a lot, but I've always keep it. I mean, I scrub it to clean it up. I use a process. A friend of mine, uh, who's a professional chef, he showed me this method and basically. It's throw some vinegar and water in it and sloshing around. And that allows that vinegar to, it, it basically loosens up all that black heat in there and it cleans out much easier. Uh, so that's what I do. Anyway, listen, I want to thank you again for coming to the channel. I appreciate you visiting us and watching um, 
the blah, blah, blah that I do. <laughs> and I want to thank you uh, for, for tuning in right now. Anyway, um, I hope you have a good evening and please leave a thumbs up, subscribe and share this channel to all your friends and family and enemies and anybody else. And um, please uh, leave a comment down below if you have any questions or any comments. I, I, I really appreciate them. Positive or negative, I'm here to to, to learn and, and share and, and help and, uh, and be helped. Anyway, thanks again. You have, you all have a good evening. Goodbye.